me. Let me see here, y'all girls. Let's see. And guys, where am I? Where's your channel? Let's see if we're, we're not even live on channel yet. Hey, everybody. Let's see. Hey, Jennifer. Hey, Gabby, you sweet angel. Uh, Mark's cutting grass at his house, and Kelly is on the porch. She's on her way down here. I said, well, you cut you kind of close, aren't you? She said, well, there's no sense in me getting there until like 6.20 or 6.30 because she talked for 30 minutes. I got something. Jennifer Cagle. Hey, Kathy Wiseman. Gabby, I'm so excited about you coming. I cannot stand it. But I want you to know I have not done the first thing in this house. But So anybody who buys anything tonight, be, don't, don't think that the world's coming to an end because I know I take Sundays off, but I'm working tomorrow. Because Monday and Tuesday, I'm going to have to clean my house. So y'all just bear with me on that one. I want you to know that I have just now gone live on my iPhone. Now, how is that possible? That's a minute. That's a 52-second delay. Let me see where I missed. Hey, LaDonna. How are you, baby? Gabs, let's see. Kathy Wiseman. Hey, Angela. How are you tonight, sweet pea? Pam, Mama Pam, how are you doing? Oh, my stars. Pennsylvania. Y'all had some good. I didn't comment on the videos, but I've tell Amy I've watched her last two. Like uh, shopping and hauls. That's a good place to. That's a good place to shop. I might have to. I might have to check that out. You know, I'm going to Patty uh, Gessner's in the end of May, and she lives in uh, New Jersey. And then she, I'm flying there, and she's going to drive me back home. So we're going to thrift and stuff and shop on the way back to my house. Ow, my back's hurting. Hey, Pat Robinson. Hi, Karen. Congratulations again on your engagement, Karen, you sweet thing. Tracy, how are you tonight, sweet pea? Hey, Gloria. Look at this. Gloria J. Bowman, Miss Glow's Crochet Creations. Do you know I haven't crocheted in forever? Lord have mercy, I haven't crocheted in forever. I usually do it every winter, too. I guess I was just too busy this winter. But I like it. It relaxes me. Hey, Sabrina. How are you tonight, sweet pea? Hey, Rebecca. Hey, Karina. Hey, Debbie. Oh, hey, Dee, you sweet angel. How are you doing tonight? And that sweet Benny. Bless his heart. He was having so much trouble tonight, wasn't he? God love that angel. He is so sweet. I feel so bad for him. Cause you know it hey you know it gets it bothers him. I mean, and it's something you can't help, but you can't help but let it bother you. I felt so sorry for him. I didn't know what to do. Cat, how are you tonight? Hey Rick, if you're there, baby. Hey Val. Hey, Joe, how are you tonight, baby? You know, that's my middle name, Joe. I was named, that was my dad's name. I was named after him. Well, all three of us kids was named after my daddy, so. He was a good man. Good, good, good man. Hey, Randy, how are you tonight? Cindy, there's my other, that's my other member of the, my, what, no, what do you call it? A guest. She's my other guest to the bed and breakfast. Yes, well, I don't know so much about bed and breakfast. Bed and Waffle House, maybe. we got a bed and a Waffle House. Let's see. Whoop, oh, dadgum, that's darn thing. Dadgum it. Let's see. Can I find it again? Hey, Dana Grace. I know it moves fast, Gabby. I, I have to... Sometimes it sometimes it'll let me catch back up and sometimes it won't. My crazy laptop. And I want y'all to know I still haven't figured out what the only thing I can figure is I think that 
I think that Katie Bug, I think my sweet Katie, is signed in or something on my YouTube. I think that that's got something to do with why my view, and it has nothing to do with y'all. Y'all, it looks the same to y'all. It's backwards to me. You know what I'm saying? Like you see that little spice cabinet right there that's looking like it's over my left shoulder to y'all? It's really over my right shoulder. And if YouTube was right, it wouldn't be. No, y'all seeing it backwards too. Backwards too. So I don't know. But it's aggravating the hair off my head. But I'm not going to mess with Kate this weekend because God knows. I found out during day sale that she's done dropped her phone in the bay in St. Augustine, Florida. And I, I can tell you from being with her when, when similar things have occurred, it has sent her in a massive state of panic. So I'm not going to bother this weekend. I'm going to let her be. I'm going to let her be with her phone debacle. Debbie Gutierrez. Gutierrez. How are you? Let's see. It is frustrating, Cindy. It is. Suzanne Sharp, how are you tonight, sweet pea? Hey, Patricia. Hey, Carrie. Miss Val. Oh, piss, 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 piss. There it goes again. Hey, Prairie Stone and Annette and Karen Kay. How are you tonight? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, thank you, Karen. Okay, y'all. Uh, Karen Chase and Vintage is, I think they said, less than 100 away from hitting her goal on her YouTube channel. So, um, if, let me, I don't know if I can put it in or not. Angela, will you put Karen Chase and Vintage's YouTube channel in? And if y'all haven't already subscribed, will you please go and subscribe to my buddy? Because she is so sweet and she supports all of us all the time. And I would just appreciate it if you'd go over and subscribe to her. Because she's a sweetie. She's a sweetheart. And Lord have mercy knows it took a village to get me above a thousand. Lord Jesus. Hey, Lynn Fogel. How are you tonight? Oh. Lamar. Betty. Hey, Betty. How are you tonight, sweet pea? You keeping Lamar in line? I can tell you right now, that's a full-time job, ain't it? I know, I know. How, but you you did such a good job raising him. I just want to tell you that. Lamar's a good guy. He is a good guy. He gets a little handsy with me sometimes, so Betty, I'm going to have to tell you. He gets a little handsy with me sometimes. I don't, I don't know how to stop that. You're going to have to tell me somewhere to stop that mess. <laughs> oh... He's going to kill me. Oh, there it went again. There it went again. Shit. Hey, Helen Casey. Oh, my goodness. Debbie's got a present for you, Lamar. Hey, Christy. How are you tonight, baby? Hey, Sandra Fish. How are you? Gosh, I hadn't seen you in a while either. Thank you for coming, honey. Hey, Christine. Well, it's just, and I apologize if I miss you. I'll try to remember if I've said hey to you or not and catch you in the chat later on because it's just, it's just jumping all over the place. Hey, Sarah Lee. I'm happy to see you too tonight, darling. I'm happy to see y'all all every Saturday night. I look forward to this. It's just like, a, I don't know. It's, it, it, you know how you look forward to a vacation or something like that? I, that's how I do. I look forward to y'all on the weekends. And next week we'll have, let's say, yeah, I'm going to have guests here at my house for the next two weeks. So my next two live sales, I'll have guests here. Gabby will be here this coming Saturday. And then Cindy will be here. I'm almost certain Cindy's going to be here for the next one too, for the next sale. If I can, if I can hog tie her into staying, she may be, I can't remember what she told me, but anyway, maybe I can talk her into staying an extra day with me. If she's planning on leaving before Saturday. Hey, all in the attic treasures. How are you tonight, Marianne? Hey, Patty. How are you tonight, sweet pea? I was just telling them about me coming to see you. I sure was. 
Let's see. You're on vacation this week, Miriam? Well, hallelujah. I know, gosh, I used to look so far. But see, I'd, I'd have so much to do at the house when I took vacation, when I worked. Well, it's the same now. You, do, you know, do you know that I actually work or spend more time? It's a different kind of work. It's a more. This is a more fun work than my salary job I had, my real, my real world job I had. But do you know that I work more hours at this job than I did my real work job? But this is more fun. Hey, Nettie. Okay, you're going back in the lurker's lounge. <laughs> you nut. You just stay right in that lurker's lounge, baby, all you want to. And hello and good evening to everybody else in our lurker's lounge. Hey, Wolves. I hadn't seen you in forever either. How are you doing, baby? It was a beautiful day in Michigan. It has been a gorgeous day here. The people who do my yard, they came today, and we was just sitting out there on the patio. That's why my eyes are so swollen. If y'all think about my eyes are so swollen, that's why, if y'all notice that. I was sitting out there with him, but he's so sweet. Frankie, he's sweet as he can be. He said, oh, Miss Bell, you have company coming? I, I blow extra good. He said, I blow extra good. Because he don't. Half the time, he don't do it. You know? I blow extra good. Oh, I know it, Virginia. Oh, there it went again. Next Saturday is spring fling at the Bear. Don't know what we'll be flinging, but it will be on sale. Well, good. Hey, Prairie Stone. Good, good, good. I'm taking Gabby to the bear. I'm taking her to the bear. I don't know what else we'll do, but we'll get into some mess. Hey, Jennifer. Hey, Joan. And Miss Mary. Hey, Robin. And Elaine. How are you tonight, Elaine? It's good to see you, darling. And that crazy Kelly Michelle telling me, I say, it's only, I've been talking 12 minutes. 12 minutes, and she tells me that I talk all night long. Well, she didn't say that. She said 20 or 30. So, you know, I got to stop. Tammy Renee and Linda, how are y'all doing, baby? I've been thinking about y'all. Where is she, Virginia? She's on her way down here. But she said she was not going to be, she was not going to be in no hurry. Because I talked y'all's head off for 20 or 30 minutes. And she's, she wants to shut me up if she comes down here. So, she just waits till I get through. Hey, Chrissy. No, she's not my boss, Patty. No, she's not my boss. Mm -mm. Hey, Maria. How are you? Please send me an email and let me know how your husband's doing, baby. I've been praying for him. Let's see. No sale with Katie and Nathan. I know it. God love that child. Do you know? Mm, I just know she's just beside herself over that. Think about all those beautiful pictures she had on her phone. <gasps> oh, I think she did the cloud. I think she's got the cloud, so she'll, they'll be saved, I think. I think they'll be saved in the cloud. But you know how much, how she takes those pretty pictures and every all the time she travels? Good. Good, 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 Maria. I'm so glad. Hey, Shelly, how are you? She said everything is backed up. Well, hallelujah. Because, you know, Katie's, she's particular about her pictures. You know, I don't know if y'all have been anywhere. Anybody who's been off with her and uh, her taking in pictures and stuff, she, she, she yeah. You'd think it was going to be in the uh, center pole of a uh, multi-million dollar subscriber magazine. Hey, Heidi. There it went again. I just know I missed somebody, but I can't tell who it is. Let's see. Let me see if it'll let me go back up. We all have cloud. My son works. <laughs> we all have cloud, like it or not. Oh, doggone it. We'll get started tonight. I have a bunch of good stuff, I think, for y'all tonight. I... 
I tried, I started out trying to get good th things, smaller things that wouldn't take me long to pack because I want to be through with my packing and invoicing tomorrow afternoon or tomorrow night. But it didn't, it didn't end up that way because I always, I always see something. I think, oh yeah, I want to put that in a cell, you know, so it's kind of half and half. Who is this texting me? Who is this texting me right now? That crazy Lamar and Daniel. Lord have mercy. Daniel is in Hawaii. And it did you he just can't stand it that uh, that I'm here and not in Hawaii with him enjoying all this beauty that he's enjoying in that ocean. So he's been sending me pictures. Let's see. Hey homeschool Lou. How are you tonight? I know I missed somebody else. May I purchase the tassels in the back behind? I had, yes, you can. Yes, you can, baby. Let me put those on there, Virginia. I was they're in the sale tonight. Now they were going to be fourteen dollars straight claim. So I'll put you down for those. Fourteen dollars, Virginia. You got it, baby. Okay, and we'll just get started. But first off, my name is Pamela, and I have a live sale here every Saturday night, unless I'm out of town or something. Yes, that's my new candle. See, I, see I'm backwards. Yes, that's my new candle, Angela. Thank you so much. Um, Let's see. Oh, I have a live sale here every Saturday night until I... <laughs> Un unless I'm going somewhere or something or been out of town or uh, sometimes when I have company, I don't do live sales if they're only going to be here a very short period of time or something. But if they're going to be here two or three days, I usually have my guest here on the YouTube channel with me. And uh, I ship from Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Well, from Northport, Alabama, but nobody knows what Northport is. Um, hey, Jamie. And uh Shipping is not included in the prices of your items, but I ship using pirate ship like my, everybody else on uh, our vintage community does, and it's not very expensive at all. Um, not it's it's um, I think almost half of what the retail would be if you walked up to the post office and tried to ship something. Hey Jennifer Cagle, how much for this? <laughs> But um, I have offer ups and straight claim items tonight, and um, <laughs> and uh, dear Angela's vintage, she's in blue here in the chat. She does my offer ups for me, my starts and stops, and I depend on her to tell me who uh, wins an uh, item because things are different um, on my screen uh, on my feeds. You know, and I just don't want to mess anybody up. Hey, happy old soul. How are you tonight, baby? And um, let's see. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Prairie Stone. Uh, I love turquoise. I have, I've kept my turquoise. Most of it I've had since I was a teenager in my early 20s. I very self, I have some new Navajo pearl earrings that I bought. Not too long ago because I just fell in love with them. But that's about the only new piece that I have. Most of it's older. Hey, Heather Elizabeth. How are you? While I'm seeing Heather Elizabeth, let me go ahead and tell y'all. Because if I don't, I forget. But I don't mean to forget. Heather Elizabeth has a live sale tomorrow. Her and uh, her channel is Antique Agenda. And it's tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. Sam from the Pink Elephant Parlor is another friend of mine. She also has a sale tomorrow. And it is at 3 p.m. Central Time. And I believe that the Chatty Cathy's, Chatty Kitties, no, Chatty Kitties have a sale tomorrow. Sabrina, if you're still in here, what? Well, there she is, I see her. Sabrina, are, are y'all having a sale tomorrow? If you are, baby, Will you uh, put the time in the chat and whose channel it's on for me? Uh, let's see who it is. It's on Sabrina's channel. Simon says, let's make a deal at 9 p.m. Okay. 
English country. Okay, I couldn't remember what your theme was. And Heather does theme sales, and she does it very well. I have fly by the seat of my pants, so I I I organized enough for theme show. But hopefully, hopefully, when Gabby gets here, she can help me get organized. That's going to be one of the little things I think me and her can do together. I'm going to ask for her input on that because it is worrying the hair off my hair. And say, y'all see all this half gray, half black stuff? We're fixing to fix that Monday. I finally have nailed down a new uh, hair, hair, hair person. I've nailed me down a new hair person and praise God and all the saints above, I have an appointment at 11 o'clock Monday morning. <laughs> Let's hope she don't get pregnant. Let's hope if she gets pregnant that she decides to keep on her cutting hair. Let's hope that she don't get divorced and move out of town because that's what happened to the other one. Let's hope that she don't just find her a rich man and quit working because that's what happened to the one prior to the one that moved. It ain't at the gas station. No, Jennifer. No, that's where I had, I, that's where I used to get my eyelashes done was down at the foot of the hill. I don't have to do that anymore because I am I am on it now. I've had I have Amazon eyelashes, and a girl up in Russellville, Alabama, showed me how to put them on, and I am a whiz at it now. I could sit here, I could do it driving down the road if I wouldn't get arrested. I'm perfect with it. I can do it. Let's see. What do y'all pray for? Oh yes, yes, you go. How are you, sweet pea? How are you and that lovely husband of yours? Oh, it's so good to see you. D, I, I will fix that. I will fix that. We will put you on some eyelashes when I come. We will put you on some. Say, Patty, I got to put Patty up too. She'd like these. These are the little bitty kind that you get. Oh, I don't have my kit in here. They little bitty, you put them on individually. Oh, it's so good to see you, darling. Okay. Okay, let's see. All right, but we're going to get started. And I have, as usual, just a variety of stuff. It is just a mixed, mixed bag here. You don't need them, Heather? Oh, I don't know what that's on there. We'll go, we'll go with it over here. Okay, first up tonight, I have... Uh, Angela, my first item is starting off at $18, baby. $18. You need them. Yours are too light. Well, see, that's what mine just fell out. Well, I still have eyelashes. They're just not as thick and long as they used to be since I've been getting in some fusions. This is for a vintage red and yellow Rivoli paints tin made in the USA. Do, 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 do. Oh, look what the cat drug in, Sister Sue. Come on over here, baby. Your adoring public has been wanting Who you. said I wasn't the boss? Patty, she's not the boss of you. Mm -hmm. Do you think you're the boss of me? Come over here. Y'all ought to see this face she's got. Come over here right now, these people, and tell them to their... Here's their little... Oh, this one's going to come out of its holder. It's got, it's still got the little original brush and all the little colors in it. Look at that, how sweet. And it says Rivoli watercolors. Before starting to paint, have paper, your paper thoroughly wet. Absorbing excess moisture with a clean white blotter. So it's just so, look at them telling hey, you. Hey, y'all. Happy old soul, Maria, cat. Hey, cat, my thing that. Yeah, I threw you under the bus, Patty. I, <laughs> hey, Sandra Fish. I don't think I said hey to her either. Bloop me, please, Miss Virginia said. Miss Virginia bought. Oh, something. yes, yes, yes. Miss Virginia bought uh, the tassels back here on the spice cabinet. I don't know if anybody's bidding on this or not. Are you opening my pen? Dad gum it. I forgot about it, Angela. I forgot all about it. Hang on a minute. Oh, Patty, but Patty being on it. She's at 18. Hold this up there, Kelly. When you get Miss Virginia in there, let me go get my treat from Angela. 
My treat from Angela came from Cat. It was so pretty. I like it. It's a frog candle holder. I should have brought it. Here you go, Miss Virginia. Bloop, bloop. Don't my candle smell good? Angela sent me that for my birthday. Yeah, it does. I saw them. We'll start the countdown on this at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and be at end. Hey, D. Hey, Auntie Gabby. Yes, Kat, I love it. It was packed so pretty, and the card was pretty, too. So to Patty G. <clears throat> Patty G for 18. Miss Patricia. Mm-hmm. I love it. Thank you, Patty. Bloop, bloop. Mark is doing good, Miss Virginia. He um was at home cutting grass. Did you say that Frankie came and cut my grass? Yeah, I did. It was good. I noticed he blew off the back, too. It had gotten messed up after we'd done it a couple of weekends ago from all the rain and storms. <coughs> well, he did it because I told him I was having company. You know, that's uh, not normally on his yeah, was wheelhouse. You have to catch him. Mm -hmm. You have to catch him. Mm -hmm. Angela sent me this. And I wanted to wait till tonight to open it up because I think she told me it was. A, yep. Happy birthday, Pam. Mm -hmm. I love you, Angela. But she sent me these. She Aww. sent me these candles. Pretty. But look what I'm fixing to be writing with. Here, you can have the chocolate cost, Pam. Ah. You can't have have it, but you can. Oh, I have have it. No, you don't have have it. Okay. Pretty sis. Look. She sent me a red feather pen. Thank you so much, Angela. I love it, baby. Uh-oh. Your scissors almost fell off. Uh-oh. Let me put them in the box. Uh-oh. Look at there. Oh, Miss Virginia. Thank I you wish. so much. Kelly looks thin. Well, she ain't losing weight. I can tell you that right now. Mayor Hurry the one are. <coughs> She is nice and kind. Yes, yeah, she is very sweet. I just love it. She's such an awesome mod. Now, friend. let me put her on here. What was the number of the of the Patty's little thing? You put it over there in the sold area. Right, look right there in front of the... Um, number 17. 17. Oh, I don't it down. Mm. <laughs> okay, let's see. I have a black feather pen. Do you want it, Pam? Shoot, y'all do. Hey, Savannah. Yeah, I want it. Hey, Miss LaDonna. You hold on to it, though. Don't you worry about Ms. it. You LaDonna just hold on to it and don't worry about spending the money on shipping it. And I'll get it. Hey, is it Miss Annette Fain in here? Yes. Yes, I think I did see her. <laughs> her IG is hilarious and cracking me up. Okay. Our next item is a little lot of antique things, and it's starting off at $26, Angela. Mm -hmm. Pretty. $26. Okay. What's wrong with my chat? I don't know, Kelly. What's wrong with your chat? But it is for this huge, beautiful mother of pearl. This is an antique mother of pearl hair comb. <laughs> and it is huge, just to give you an idea. See, this thing is backwards. This is worrying a hair off my head. I don't even know how you use these, but you know how big it is. I mean, you can see it is four inches wide and it is three and a half inches tall. So four inches wide and three and a half inches tall. And with it, you get this antique carved lucite. Look at that carving on this hat pin. Look at the end of it. The beautiful. Oh, hold on. Let me get that. There's the bottom of it with that <clears throat> sweet little uh, protector on the bottom. And then you come down here. Let me get this in. Oops. Dadgummit. There it is. Look how pretty that is. That is so detailed and carved. Let me see if I can. No, that's too far away. Maybe this would show the carving up better. Nope. 
Take my word for it. It is gorgeous. Can't we get you something darker colored? No, it was, it's going to do all right, <laughs> I think. But there's the back of it. Let me see the overall length on this one. This one's come out of my personal collection, too. Well, all of them do. I haven't bought any new hat pins. This some. one is four and a quarter inches long. Four and a quarter inches long. So you get both these pieces, this huge mother of pearl and this carved lucite hat pin. Me and this, me and this stream yard are going to fight. Did you hear that <coughs> Katie has dropped her phone in the bay at St. Augustine doing the boat tour? No. Yeah. Her and Nate, Naders are not going to have a sale tonight. Katie has, and I think that Katie has signed into my stream yard is the reason that my thing is back backwards or something. I think that's got something to do with it. Are you serious? Bless her heart. That's Don't you know she's, no, nah, she's she, beside herself. We'll start the countdown on this at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one, and be at end. They are not pearls. They're little, um, they're little clear rhinestones, Corina. They're just little clear rhinestones, but this is like the you screw this on and off of the of the hat pin. I see uh Angela so put in. It almost looks like a Spanish. Pin, pinetta, pin, pin, pinetta. Pinetta. I got married wearing the oh. oh, Cindy. That's sweet. Oh, Karina got that. Thanks, hey, Karina. Karina. Thank you so much. <laughs> Number 10. You bloop blooping, Karina? Aren't you? Yeah, you it? just made it. Katie just needs to stay away from those Apple products. Right, Miss LaDonna? Bloop, bloop. <laughs> LaDonna, don't be. Uh-uh. Don't but encourage I hate, Katie. But I hate that. I hate that for her. That's because she loves to take pictures and that kind of thing. Okay. I've got to move this. Or I'm going to bust my butt on that envelope. Why is your chair over there? I don't know because my back's hurting and I wanted to stand up. I'm sorry. Okay, uh, Miss Cindy, Cindy uh, Mimi's treasure cottage said the uh, pinata is much larger but very similar. Oh, okay. All right. Up next, I have an ephemeral light that is a cool ephemeral light. <laughs> it is starting off at thirty six dollars, Angela. Thirty six dollars on this ephemeral light. And first up in the ephemeral light, this is the small packet of vintage things. Okay. Is is it going to be better if I turn this off? Is it going to be better? Because something I'm not liking. Here is the, or maybe, no, I need it on, maybe just. Thank you for that, Pluto. But in here, you're going to get some of this, all this whole bag of this mica glitter flakes. These are the flakes. It's not, um. It's it's not like the small small glitter like you like you can buy in the store. Hey Sally, you're gonna get. Hey Sally, you're going to get all of this vintage ribbons and trims. You're going to get one each of these cards out of a hearts, a old Whitman's hearts bit. <clears throat> hey Felicia, moonflowers. Felicia stole. Vintage buttons. You're going to get all of these vintage cards. You've got a vintage Christmas box card. You have a Easter card. Cute. A Merry Christmas to Mommy. Kitty, kitty. Pardon me for busting in upon your privacy. Another little Easter card. You get this. Look at that netting. Like... And you get to my wife. I don't have an oil well, not even a share. 
a big old card for your wife. Okay. So that's that part of it. That goes in that bag. And then you also in the true vintage, you get this postcard. Show these little buttons. Yeah, I did, baby. You get all of these Victorian scraps, die cuts and scraps, calling cards. There's over a hundred pieces, a hundred and something pieces in here. Delbert. Hey Delbert. How's it going? You get all of these original invoices. I have scanned these in. I have them, but you're getting the originals. These are from 1910, 1912, 1902. These are original grocery store receipts. I got these on the world's longest yard sale. This is from State Savings Bank. This is from 1907 from a bank. This it's it's funny to me to see what things cost. On February the 5th, March 20. Oh, no, they build them on March 22nd. Federal the, Biscuit Company. The Federal Biscuit <clears throat> Company. F.H. Richardson, they bought a, a barrel of flour. So I guess they were fixing to be at, uh, bake something. The Smart and Fox Company, that's, that's on their account, the Smart and Fox Company. Simon Brothers, these are all original invoices. Invoices, um, st bank statements, look at that. I mean, it's just full of stuff, okay? We've got all of those. I think there's 17, 16 or 17 of those actual antique invoices in there. Then you've got, let me put those together. Then you've got this little page out of a photo album of all of these black and white pictures. You've got this out of a, a it's kind of like a field guide, but not really a field guide. This side has mushrooms. This has side has the hawthorn bush. You've got a North America map out of an old atlas. Mushrooms. And then you've got all of these, I don't, dozens of cutouts that I have cut out of my vintage magazines. Ads. Let me just show you a few. Look at that. This is on the at a country club. We'll be there for Christmas, Mother, South Central Bell or Bell South. Look at all these ads. Now I left the ads all in one strip so you could cut out what you wanted because they're on both sides. Ah, <clears throat> just just hundreds of ads or dozens. I shouldn't say hundreds. Hey, Daddy. Dozens of ads. Hey, Nancy. Recipes from 1932. Hey, Nancy. Hey, Heidi Perry. Um, stories. Okay. And all kind of little words cut out. And you get a whole magazine full of things that you can cut out on your own. There was so much in this one, I didn't even bother cutting it out because there's good stuff on both pages and I wanted to let whoever got it decide on what they wanted to cut out and use. Then you also get a Birds in Bloom magazine, which has beautiful nature pictures in it. All kind of birds and stuff. If you want to, if y'all have ever seen Tarnished Treasures, um, glue books and season books and th stuff, you could use that for this. Or this for that. Then you get Miss Patricia is at 36. One, two, three, four, four pieces of cardstock. You get all of this ribbons, laces, and trims. <coughs> this makes me think of a gaper's box. You get all of these Tim Holtz die cuts of Victorian era things. Uh Quill pens, fountain pens, Auntie Gabby's at 38. bicycles, um, just all of these Victorian uh, themed die cuts. You get one, two, three, four Tim Holtz frames. These are chipboard frames. Coming back at 40. You get all of these little things from my, um, what do you call them, like my scanned images. These are just little sayings and stuff you can cut out and put on different things. <clears throat> 
Also this, you get just missing that thing at 42. All of this. Bingo cards. Unfinished, I mean undone bingo cards. Tidy at 50. And just, it's just top, top full of 100, uh, it's over 100 pieces of stuff in here. But it would be, it, it would be a fun crafting lot to have. And we'll start the countdown on it at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. <clears throat> and be at end. It's got it all. I mean, it's going to be fun. Now, if you buy this plus something else, just know that I am going to ship this separately uh, in a package all by itself because I can ship this in a huge padded envelope with cardboard around it to protect it. And if I put it in a box with something, the box is going to have to be, the box would be too big, if you know what I'm saying. It'd just be too big to ship it. But this right here, I bought a pound of this. You know what I mean, this mica. So <clears throat> when I do ephemeral packs now, I'm going to put some of that in there, in each one of them. Oh, look and this is old, old stuff. It's not, it's not in reproduction or new. Okay. You got your things together? Oh, let me see. Uh -huh. Yeah, I got my thing. Patty must have got it. So to Patty. Thanks, Patty. Thank y'all, everybody who bid on it. Because I had fun making it, and it is full of stuff. I don't know if all this went in here, but I'm going to put it in here. That's fine. Patty knows what's vintage and what's not. I just had it separated so I could have what. Yes, you got it right. All of that page right there, pack right there is true vintage. Thank y'all so much. <clears throat> okay, let me put this back together. And what number was it? Number 10. What the shit was that? What the hell was that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Don't don't don't, don't look back there. Don't look back there. Don't I, look back there. I'm gonna address my fear. Hello. What was it? I heard it ticking. Was it a squirrel? Was it ticking? Yeah. Are you sure? You got you rewound this clock up back here. I did wind the clock up. But that wasn't making that noise. <gasps> unless the alarm, unless the alarm was set. I don't know. <laughs> oh, God. Well, I don't know. Did I you put Miss Patty in the box? Miss Patricia's in there. <laughs> <laughs> did y'all hear it? It sounded I like, said she heard it. It did sound like a rattlesnake. <laughs> sounded like a rattlesnake. It did. You didn't hear it? Shut your mouth. That's why I turned down. around like I did. Look, open a dishwasher. Mama, what's wrong with you? It was this darn clock. It had to be. Let's try it. I didn't set the alarm, but that don't mean it wasn't set. I wound it up. Let's see what it sounds like when the alarm goes off. Hold on. Because, you know, I can't be standing here. What time is it? 742. Let's just pretend like it's eight. We're going to set the alarm for eight. Okay, how do you set the alarm? Julie, oh. Julie, Julie! <laughs> Damn it. I think it was Miss LaDonna. What did she think? It's the clock. I think it was the clock, too. I think it just sounded weak or something. Excuse me. The hands blow. That was it. Oh. Damn you, Kim. Tell you what's true. Any dolls tonight? <laughs> yeah, I do have a doll tonight. Stuff's happening. Oh. Look, this makes me get real. Is Patty asking me because she really wants a doll, or is she asking me because she thinks something's in here is haunted? Like I got a Hank in here with me. <laughs> do those hands glow? Yes, they do. They glow like the let's matter of fact, let's do this. <laughs> 
They glow like no god's Woo. business. Large baby band clock. Rattlesnake clock. Perfect condition. $22. Start at $22. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can see that, but yes, they do glow. Let me see. Let me Turn off the lights and I'll glow to the extreme. <laughs> see? And they glow when the lights go out. Yes, ain't it, Gabby? <laughs> Haunted clock, $80. She's a short. Auntie Gabby said, remember the haunted box? Oh, gosh, yes. <laughs> Light bulb's blue. <laughs> Miss LaDonna said, your, your darn squirrel has migrated down there, there, I guess, and been sitting on her deck for two days. <laughs> oh, he ain't. That must be his cousin, LaDonna, because mine's still out here. <laughs> at me every time I go out the door. Like I'm bothering him. Being in the middle of my driveway. He went crazy the other day when I pulled up. That shaking pant his, is everything. I'm telling you. Shaking his tail at me. He's waiting on Cindy to come back. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't have it wound up a lot for Patty. I think that's the reason why it was sounding like like that because mm -hmm. it wasn't wound up all the way <laughs> but see how big it is i mean it's usually the ones i bring That's are big the bin. smaller ones this is a big bin it's not a baby bin this is the big bin but i don't see any interest in it but we're gonna we're afraid of the clock <laughs> <laughs> ah! no we're not gonna have no squirrel stew baby but just said it was the bear Miss Patty Crane, is it 22? Oh, Patty Crane. Hey, Patty, I didn't see you earlier. Thank you for coming, baby. <laughs> Most bands I know are big. <laughs> Can they cry, Albert? Albert! Let me get this off of here. Look at that. What? Hey, Miss Hazel. Hey, Hazel Ellis. How are you, baby? Heather. What did Jennifer Miller say? Jennifer Miller. You're brave, Patty. <laughs> We'll start the countdown on this at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid end. Hey, my true crime people that in here do y'all uh y'all see where they made uh arrest in the two missing moms case um, a little while ago <clears throat> so, so patty, patty. Crane. thanks patty thank you patty and it ain't haunted it's not haunted. it's not haunted it's a good big bin it's a good big bin <laughs> i've had that in a long time and it ain't done nothing to me like walking across the counters or nothing at night <laughs> Okay, let's see. All right, y'all. Ne up I next is this. Bloop, bloop. Hey, Shannon. Necklace. This is seven. This is a necklace I made out of a broken rosary and a uh, antique uh, belt buckle. And I'm going to take it off and let you see it. It starts off at $18, Angela. $18. And here is the buckle. Well, got my hair in it. That's pretty. Thank you, baby. <laughs> here she is wants the... to make sure you go ship that clock before she gets here. <laughs> yeah, Cindy. <laughs> there is the buckle. And here is the... <laughs> now, these are crystal... Um, these aren't plastic. Well, are they plastic? Are that plastic or glass, Kelly? Mm, I think they're glass. I don't... If you, you're going to let me see it? Yes, I'm going to let you see it. Hold on, do this. I think they're plastic. Okay, we'll see how long it is. You going to measure it? Here's your number stick. You measure it, because I don't know how to measure. Tap it on your tooth, she said. Corina said tap it on your tooth. Tap, tap. What do you think? 
I don't know. Tw 14, 14 inches long. So we'll start to count down on this. I see some beds on it at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bed end. <laughs> Cindy's driving. Oh, driving here. Driving. I thought she meant she's driving here. I see Angela's sold. Gabby. Oh, Gabby, thank Gabby. you. You sweet thing. You can just keep that till she gets here. I will keep it till she gets here. I will keep that for that baby. Bloop, bloop. Okay, up next is, starts at $18, Angela, $18, and it is for this Ohio Art 10 Litho Dolls Tea Set. There's the little thing on the bottom. It has four cups. Kelly's going to show one up close. Look at the little poodle. It has three of the little saucers. It has four of the little this size plate, the little poodle plates, and then I put these in here with it. This is the larger, like a luncheon style dolls plate, and these were eight dollars each at the antique mall. I mean, I I didn't buy them for eight dollars each, but I bought these from an antique booth that closed out. This person. Uh, retired, and I bought some of her stock. Thank you, Miss Nancy. Yes, Tammy. Yes. So there's three of those big plates. Thanks, Hazel. Thank you. Four of these smaller ones. Three of the three tiny of ones, and four of the cups. And four little cups. Made in Ohio. It's got to be good. <laughs> that is one of Ariana's shirts. Yes, Hazel this Atlas. Is Ariana's shirt. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> But we'll, I don't see any interest in it yet, but we'll start the countdown. Ooh, it's cute. I know it. At 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid end. Is Karen Chasing Vintage still in here? Karen Chasing Vintage. I see Angela stop, so we don't have anybody for that one, so we'll put it to the side. Karen, did your uh, base arrive okay? I had it packed within an inch of its life and two different. I know she thought this girl has lost her ever loving mind. <clears throat> Hey, you like to show jewelry. Here you go. Here you go, baby. There's your one. You like to do that. You can tell about it. All right. This is the offer up starting at 14. It's for this vintage 1960s three-strand necklace. I'll show it on the mannequin. It is beautiful shades of aqua, teal, and gold. And it's just really, really pretty. Look at the shape of this bead right here. The one in the middle. Yeah, I will take that to Misty's, Patty. I think I will. Let me. Matter of fact, let me go and put it right in there with the stuff I'm taking to Misty's. I will put that right in here. That's the class. I'll get y'all a measurement here. It's about nine and three quarters inches long, so it's kind of short. Let me show you what it's going to look like on. 
you're going to have to start wearing solid color shirts to model the jewelry. <laughs> I'm the facilitator here. You're the facilitator? Yeah. Some vintage gold. Oh, hey, right Kendra. Thank you, baby. Thank you so much. It's pretty, isn't it, y'all? It's like a... Where can I buy a fish hook clasp? I can send you some fish hook clasp, D. You need some? Girl, that's Kelly Michelle. I've got a jewelry. I've got a jewelry finding store here. Oh, Patty, bye, honey. Mwah. You have a good night, too, and thank you for coming by, hon. I see. Christy Tippy Winks. Hey there, baby. At 14. Hi, oh, Robin, bye. Thank you, Gabby. I love you, too. Maybe not with that shirt. No, maybe not with that shirt. <laughs> but it is pretty. It is a pretty necklace. It's very pretty. Uh-oh. All right, we're going to start the countdown at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid in. And bid in. I see Angela's soul. Thank you, Angela. Mm -hmm. Hey, there's Danny. That's who I was asking about last time. You know, Danny Lewis. That's Hi, all right, Danny. Danny. I was wondering, we missed you last week. No worries, baby. Hope everything's going good there. Yes, you was. Hey, you asked me about yeah. him. Danny, tell us again where you're from, please. So to Tippy. Yay, Christy. Thanks, baby. London, London. I said, I think in the UK. Yay, right. Okay. Uh-oh, my pen. Hey, Nightmare. Hey, Nightmare. Bloop, bloop. Christy's in the bucket with y'all. Yes, Auntie Gabby went to London. Yes, she did. Her and her fans. Uh, Angela, oh, my next item video. is a little lot of two pieces of vintage Christmas, and it's starting off at $18. And it is for this vintage box. Uh, greeting cards came in here from Norcross. From four of us. Mm -hmm. And it says $25 for a dollar. Look how cute 25 for a dollar. You ain't going to 20... get 25 and nothing And it's got a little bitty, a family of little bitty bears. Uh, sitting in front of a fireplace, and the card was uh, from the four of us. And it comes with this vintage celluloid, I really think he's antique, um, Santa ornament. He's got that, the wide kind of metal hook on the top of his head that's made into him, if you can see that. But there you, and he is in extremely good condition. I mean, extremely good condition. He is. If these were at the Dollar Tree today, they'd be a dollar and a quarter. A dollar and a quarter. Actually, a dollar seventy-five. Didn't they go up again? What you looking for, Mom? The, my white. Huh? My white. Or no, this one. I do. He is four and three-quarter inches tall. Uh, Cindy, let me check, baby. No. There are no cards in the box, no. But something was department 15, item number 84 and 59 cents. This is in the box. I know that's department 15, item number 84, 59 cents. Here's the back of him. Here's the box is in perfect condition. Yes, yeah, good box. Cindy likes this kind of stuff. Mary says she has the Santa. Mary Dugan has I'll go Santa. ahead and count it down. I don't see any interest, but we'll go ahead and count it down at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 
and bid end. Ah, Jennifer, dollar fifty with seven dollars again. Their top price now. Nine what blue. Nine blue. I'm gonna put sold in. Yeah, she's putting sold like like uh, pass. You know, it's it's okay. She means stop. I mean stop. I got you, sis. I know what you mean. Okay. Same, same. That's right. Do the set of three cheapies, Kelly. These are starting off at cute. $16. $16. It's for a, a trio of cupies. I'll show them to you close up. They're sitting different. Like this one is sitting down on, <laughs> on his little bottom. With his hands out like that <clears throat> to the side. This one's got his legs pulled together. <laughs> babies, Cindy, Cindy. Yes, babies. And then this one. These cupies were going. Uh, people was oh, good them. night, Heidi. Thank you good for night, coming, Heidi. baby. He's pondering, yeah. Who's this pondering? one is, I think so. <laughs> people was wanting these little cupies a couple year or two ago, wasn't they? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I gotta get my hair up, it's weird. I was watching people mud larking this week by Wandsworth Bridge. Oh, uh, Danny, Auntie Gabby did that in London, I think. She got a. Uh... <laughs> or y'all may have already been in a conversation about it. I'm sorry. I wasn't watching. All right. I don't see any interest in the little cutie, so we'll say stop. Or 15, 14, 13, 12, 11. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid in. Felicia Sosa, Ariana would name them Pickle, Winkle, and Fickle. Pinkle, Winkle, and Fickle. Next. Okay. Next up, I have... A choice, but they're all the same. So hey, Lenny? I have five. Pe hey, Lenny, I have worry. five things that are crafting little lots that are going to be ten dollars each, and I'll give you the number to put in after I show them to you. Hey, they're Sandy Spiff. Hey, Sandy. They're all the same. They're going to be ten dollars for each little lot, and you get. Let me. One more minute. Yeah, this one. Because I didn't have all the napkins in that one. You will get one of these huge scallop shells. A huge scallop shell. I mean, huge. And you're going to get napkins that you can decoupage. Now, these aren't these aren't cheap napkins. These are cap caprini and Something else, Caperni or something. I don't know, but I buy them at Anna Kate and Company anyway. They're a foo foo place. Foo foo, look at that. So you get uh, three of these toile, these French looking napkins. Three of these. Hey, Helen, how are you? Hey, Miss Helen. You get two of these monkey ones. You get two of these be yourself with a floral border. And you get one, two, three of the pink flamingos. And these are for decoupaging on these scallop shells. Okay. But I gave you enough to where if you want to decoupage on something else, you can. I mean, they fold out. They're beautiful and they fold out. So you get one scallop shell and all these napkins, the same amount of napkins, the same print and everything in each little bag. They're $10 for each little set. And they're number 21. And I have five of them fixed. 
21. So if you want one, put the number 21 in. Are you at it? Or? Yes, Karen, she's coming to see me. Hey, Karen. Hey, Miss Cheryl Cornette. Annette Fain wants one. Annette, do you want one? Denise, or do you want more? One I normally one. invoice on Monday or Tuesday, but this week I'm having to invoice tomorrow night, baby. Annette Fain, Jamie. Hey, Annette. Jamie. Annette Fain, Jamie, and D. Annette Fain. Jamie. Just one? Okay, Miss Annette. Is there any difference? No. There's, okay. They're all the same. Okay. I was just checking. Jamie Crafton. Jamie, do you want just one? And D bug. D. Thank you so much. I've got y'all three. And then if anybody's watching the replay and they would like one of the other two, you can just email me or uh, anything you see that hasn't sold. If you're watching on replay, you can email me and ask me about it. And I can uh, let you know if it's still available. And Kelly's getting y'all into the drawing. There's Miss Annette. Blue, blue times three. Blue. <laughs> Jamie. Blue, blue. And D. Okay, let's see. All right, Angela, my blue, next blue. item starts off at $18, and it is for a lot of Renoir. Y'all know anything about doll furniture? That will mean something to you. Renoir doll furniture. I forget how many pieces. Dang, damn it, I didn't write it down. But you have a little chest of drawers, and there's um Mr. two drawers that open. Can we see Miss Denise's question? Thank you. Do you require a 24-hour payment? I do. I usually like for you to pay within 48 hours, Denise. Oh, Miss Annette Fang wants two. But if you uh if you have I got you, Miss Annette. And out and insinuate um if you will just email me the circumstances, then I can uh I can work around that. Hey Steph, how are you, baby? So you get the chest of drawers. That's one. Let me just see how many pieces it is first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen pieces of Renoir doll furniture. You get the chest of drawers with the opening. You get the park bench. You get the bathroom sink. You get the um, little sectional sofa. Now, there's three little pieces broken off of the back of the sofa here. Hey, Debbie. Well, welcome, honey. I hope you have a good time. And if you have any questions about anything or how anything's done, you just let us know. Here's, Here's a little room. table. Well, hello, Debbie Jacobs. Glad to have you. A bathtub. A little baby's uh, walker potty combo. Little rocker. This dresser is cute. A little uh, end table. A dining table with four chairs. Dining table with four chairs. The, oh, these are in fantastic condition. A pink and blue rocker. An ironing board. Oh, the ironing board. A little wagon and a sewing machine. So there's 17 pieces and it's starting off at um, $18. So you got the wagon, the ironing board, uh-oh, the sewing machine, the table, four chairs, the high chair, the rocking chair, the bathtub, the sink. Look at this couch. And the little dresser. <laughs> it is so precious. Bench. But that's okay. If, it, if I don't see, if there's not any interest in it, I can bring it back at another time. Okay, but we can pass on that one, Angela, and I can bring it back some other another sale. Hey, Steph. Isn't she the sweetest thing? Yeah. Hey, baby. Steph likes it when I say hey, baby. 
Hey, Sharon Olson, how are you doing? Okay, let's see what else we get. Oh, let's do this one. Okay. Angela, this next lot starts off at $16. And it is for a vintage lot of things from London. Hey, this Debbie. is a Britannia Designs souvenir plate. This is from Scotland. And with it, you're going to get this... Uh, this is the coronation of Queen Elizabeth um, horse brass. So you got, I put these together in a little lot because they were from England and we've lost our sweet queen or their sweet queen. To me, she's mine too, because I love it. But um, you get both pieces of this in this lot. This is a little souvenir, like a souvenir plate of Scotland in different places. Here's the back. And I think some of these places have changed. I remember, seems like somebody had been there or something and told me that a couple of these places were different names or weren't there anymore. And then you get this horse brass, which these were decorations that used to go on the side of, or they still do, um, go on the side of horses' bridles in their, in their tack as a decoration. But this is the little lot, and we'll start the countdown at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid in. Uh, I sure have, Steph. Is Steph into that mess, too? It's Steph into that mess, too. Ha! Huh? Is she? God knows. Are y'all all into this true crime? They've probably been seeing me. Uh, Gabby, yay, baby. I'm on it. Shit, look, press Another stone. Person. Yeah. Kelly is all about that mess. I don't want to listen to none of that. We are so different, ain't we? We are so different. It's unreal. These, uh, these people gonna have to do better about some of these things. Okay. Up next, I have just some straight claims. Hang on a minute. Let me oh, get my these card. are antique. Well, I don't know if they're antique. They're vintage. I don't think they're antique. Well, what is it? But they're Something four antique is twenty five years, right? No, vintage is twenty five years. Antique's a hundred. Oh, see. okay. Well, it's not antique. No, it's not antique. Okay, so we're going to do this A, B, C, and D. Okay, we have got a straight claim on some vintage birthday candles. Okay, and I'm going to give you, I'm going to show you the packages. And give you a letter, and they're just gonna be. How? What did I say? Huh? Did I say? What did I say? There was. Oh, these candles don't come apart. You see? Yes, I see. I see. Are gonna be eight dollars a box. Here are is a little red box of fairy candles. You can see there is wear and age to the candle. I mean, to the box and the candles. And some of them There's are the separated. Back. Some of them aren't. This one is letter A, <clears throat> and it's $8. Letter A, $8. Really, Sharon? I'm on limit. Okay. So I'll put that one up because I don't see any interest in it. Okay, Kelly. Hold on a minute. Oh, Gabby got A. Hold on. Gabby got A. This one's going to be uh, B mm -hmm. right here. That one's going to be B, and it's going to be $8. Some of them, you see how some of them are melted together, and some of them aren't in this box. <laughs> that one is B for Look $8. Look at the back of this one. What does Gabby put an S in there for? <laughs> oh, B. Gabby got B. Thank you, baby. This one's going to be C. Mm -hmm. 
Betty Bowling, is that what that says? Yeah. That's the bot. C for eight dollars. Cindy got that one. <laughs> Thank you, Cindy. Cindy, you want me to hold these till you get here or you want me to mail them to you, baby? I'm holding Gabby stuff. This one's gonna be D. Hey, Peachy Me. Hi, Peachy. Gabby got D. Okay. Thank y'all so much. Precious angels. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Picture me, I saw in D cell where you had to go back in the hospital, honey. I am so sorry. Cindy said yes, hang on to him. Yeah, hang on to him. Will do. Okay, let's see. Now, this is a little kitchen lot. Kelly's going to show them to you. It's just a little vintage kitchen light. If you've got a little box or a little place in your kitchen where you can set things up. Is this some kind of stamp? Uh, that is a cookie press. A cookie press. A vintage cookie press. Of an angel. Mm -hmm. uh, putting it, a start. Putting a, This light starts off at $14. $14 on this light. Coleman's mustard can. And you get the uh, Farley's silk, the box of Farley silver. There's a name for these, and I can't remember. Silver on top, 10 cent with a little, still got the foil label on it, and it is full of the little things. So you get all three pieces of the little kitchen paraphernalia, starting at $14 on an offer up. What is that? What are these called? Farley silver on tops. Dredgy, dredgies. I couldn't think to save my life. Okay. But I can't believe they're still in there. I'll all in there. I found I think two or three of these. Hattie Crane is at 14. What is that do? What what is that? Dragies? What is that? It's little things you put on the top for decorations like cupcakes or whatever. It's like sprinkles. Oh. It's like what ours is sprinkles. Are they edible? Um contains sugar and silver coloring. Sold as decoration. Not as confectionery, so I would say no. Oh, D says yes, they're they're edible. Tooth crackers, I love those things. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> yes, but they are really hard. Dre J's. Dre J's. Okay. <laughs> we'll start the countdown. I don't know. Oh, yeah, Patty's in. We'll yeah. start the countdown on this lot at 15, 14, 13. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, They're saying um, one, that you can eat them. They're just hard. Bit end. Hi, Verna. Hey, Verna. They were invented by Dennis, probably so. <laughs> Sold to Patty. Thank you, Patty. For 14. Thanks, baby. Hey, Nate. Nader, what's happening? What's happening, Tater Nader? How are you? Okay. Up next, we have a book. Angela, this is starting off at $12. This is called Social to Save Book, and it's from 1895 by Amos R. Wells, Entertainments for the Home Circle in the Society. There's the little spine. And it is from 1895. This belonged to Miss Fern Davidson. Let me see if it's got the United States. Yes. 1895. What have I got on my finger? The magic, magic marker. marker. But this is just a sweet book. You can use it as a riser. It's got pretty color on it. Or you can just stand it up. I mean, it's 140 years old. 
No, no. 130 something though. 130 years old. Is somebody burning outside? Probably. Yeah. Or either it's my candle. Uh uh. It, no, it's like a, a leaf burning. Kelly, Kelly hears things. She smells things. She. I don't hear things as in something that's not actually there. To that's be what I know. But you're you, you're in tune to things like that's what yeah. I mean. I'm not meaning that you're. Be like I hear things. <laughs> She hears voices. <laughs> we'll start the countdown on this one at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid end. Sally wants Nate's bread in her oven. Kelly Cray Cray. Shut the Personal hell cray up. Cray. Nader, Nader, Nader. <laughs> Miss Betty was in here. Lamar was at his mama's, and he had Miss Betty in here. I told Miss Betty that she sure did raise a good son, but she was going to have to do something because he just could not keep his hands off of me. <laughs> Don't you know? Don't you know he got to talk to? Too? I'd have loved to have been a fly on the wall. I said he's fun. He he's sweet as heck, but he just can't keep his hands off of you. Don't leave no more alone. <laughs> ah, who got that? She's like the aggravating sister, ain't she, Lamar? <laughs> Felicia, thank you, baby. <laughs> Lamar, that's the way to get her. Lamar says she didn't hear you. She did. <laughs> Dang it. And don't get everything that people send anymore. I will send you from work email. ID. Okay. Okay, sweet baby. That's fine. Just tell that's her in fine. your email that that's you. Yes. <laughs> Dead gummit. <laughs> Lamar. <laughs> you probably turned the volume down on her. Don't you worry. <laughs> don't you worry. I'll get her. Me and her's got to talk anyway. <laughs> Okay, up next is a piece, of, another piece out of my collection, and, oh, let's see. Oh, I've done messed up. Hold on just a minute. Let me get my, let me get my mistake picture. Is that not the best? I wish I'd have invented that. Oh, darn. Oh, honey, don't you know? Oh, I don't know what that went to. Okay. Oh, shoot. Hold on a minute. Yes, we'll do that one. Okay, Angela, my next item starts off at $22. <clears throat> and it is for this antique morning pen. This is done with long tube beads and seed beads in beautiful black. There's the top of it. And it is just shiny. There are no beads missing or anything. Let me see how long this is. I, I, I'm having so much trouble keeping up with my ruler tonight. I just don't know what the deal is. It is eight inches long. Eight inches long. And let me get a close-up on you for y'all on these beads. They are so shiny and beautiful. And now here's the top. And then here's the bottom of it. It is just so, so beautiful. These are, I, I hesitated and hesitated about this and my jewelry <laughs> caskets. And some of my vintage jewelry is the last things that I, uh, that I have been bringing, brought, decided to sell some of, out of my lot uh, collection, but you know, I know that y'all know me long enough to know that I'll know y'all to take good care of them. But we will start the countdown on this piece at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. And that's not nothing wrong with the beads. That's where I had that cleaner on the stick pin part. And I just didn't rinse it good. But I will get that out for you. That's nothing wrong with the beads there. That was my cleaner. Uh, eight, 
seven, six, five, four, <coughs> three, two, one, and bid end. It is pretty. I have a few of these, and I love them. They're not all the same. I mean, they're all different, but I love them. LaDonna! Yay, LaDonna! Thank hey, you, baby. Let me get LaDonna in here. Get Heller in the box. Heller. Thank you, baby. Number 20 goes to LaDonna. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. It's not showing. Sure. I'm sorry, there baby. Go. I got it. Miss LaDonna collects those, I think. Mm -hmm. Does she collect mm -hmm. them, too? LaDonna, do you collect these, too? One time she said... I didn't know yeah, that. Said, yeah, I collect these. That's why I was. Well, I did not know that, honey. Well, I'm glad you're a regular on here because I am thinning my I am thinning my hoard of these. So that is a good thing. And I know you'll take good care of them. Okay. Let's see. Let me do. Tammy Bennett, uh, do you have your email pulled up, Mom? I do not, but I can you put it in there for me? No, she's one. I, we need to check your email real quick. Uh, go to the next tab over. Yes. Yeah, we got it, Tammy. We just did, baby. We just looked at it. Yes, Tammy. Yeah, it came through. Thank you, Thank baby. You. It sure did. Thank you, honey. Um, okay, sorry, excuse me. Angela, my next light starts off at $16, honey, and it is for this vintage Christmas light. It is for this little now, he has like a hairline crack going through him, but he is still, um, we call it like sound. I mean, Thank he's not, Sharon. he's not compromised. He's like a little lenticular Santa Claus mug. Little bitty short one. He's just marked Japan on the bottom. And with it, you get this Christmas story. And it is to my adorable Marsha on her seventh birthday. Loving, lovingly Nana. And that's dated 1966 on the inside. Oh, I see, Tammy. Okay, we'll put you down for that. And it's 1934 is when it was by. And this is the most beautiful story for a child to understand about the birth of Jesus. It is just really, really. Now, this has been reprinted many times, but this is the original. This is the original story of the Christmas story. And there's a picture of baby Jesus swaddled in his clothes <clears throat> with his two doves on each side. And it is just absolutely beautiful. Uh, can we do Tammy? Uh, we sure can yeah. in just a second. I was just asking if it was okay to do that. I wasn't. Yes, saying we do can it do right that now. I didn't want to overstep my. You stay in your lane. Hey, you worry about yourself. No, thank you. Worry about yourself. No, thank you. You worry about yourself. <laughs> but I don't see any interest in this, so we'll put that to the side. And then Tammy Bennett wanted the doll furniture. Yeah. What number was it? Uh, right here. I got it. Number 11. $18, Tammy Bennett. Thank you, Tammy. It was a good deal on there, see? Y'all should have looked it up. Because she's not the boss. That's what Patty said, ain't it? She's not the boss of you. She's not the boss Tammy, of you. Tammy, I'll get you in the bucket. Just a second. What is, it, what is LaDonna getting a display case for? Probably some of her stuff. Her, uh. Well, I know that, Kelly. A morning hair wreath. Oh, oh. gosh. Bloop, bloop. Abby sent me one. Abby sent me one for a Where's present. Where's Mark? He's got a referee classical, so sir. <laughs> he don't 
don't mess with us, does he? He lets us go. He don't try anymore. No. <clears throat> okay. Let's see. Oh, let's do this one. Angela, this next item starts off at $16, baby. That's vintage. And it is this vintage box of shiny bright glass ornaments in this absolutely amazing in good condition box with its original five red shiny brights in there. Shiny bright. Let's see. Starlight. Do, 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 do. And it is just absolutely precious. Now this is, you can see how different this one is. There is a difference in the shiny bright vintage shiny bright boxes this is like a chipboard box now i don't know what the difference is but i don't know if this one is older than the other ones but all of the ones i have in my collection are not this sturdy and good this is jennifer this is really really good well you can see how thick it is see it's just like chipboard but it, this is a great great display for christmas time pretty this, if y'all have ever seen anybody on Instagram or anywhere where they stack up their different boxes or different things that they have a collection of at Christmas time, it's just so wonderful. This is bugging me. But we'll start the countdown on this at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one and be at end. Angela, can you put in Stephanie's channel link in the comments, baby? So people can go over to her. Yeah, Gabby, yay! Gabby for 16. Thank you, sweet pea. Is this your potatoes? What is, yes, that's my potatoes, Kelly. Yes, I have five pounds of potatoes on the floor because I eat baked potatoes twice a day. Yes. You're going to fool around, and I'm going to move in with you. You're going to fool around and be, be trying to get me, trying to take care of me, and boss me around, and I'm going to be at your door with my suitcase. Saying I'm here. Now, see, that shut you up, didn't it? That shut you right up. Because you know you don't want me living up there. Okay. Angela, my next item starts off at uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Wednesday. What, baby? Uh, Cindy was asking about it. Yes, Gabby will be here Wednesday. She gets here Wednesday, sweet baby. Um, My next item starts off at $28, Angela. Oh, and it is for another one of my, another one of my antique little flapper dolls with their original crepe paper dress. Now, this one does have some water damage. She had water damage on her when I bought her. Uh, her little dress is like a, a olive green color. Well, thank you, Debbie Jacobs. Debbie Jacobs says that you have some great items. Thank you, baby. All of her gold hair is still real pretty. She still has her little hat piece on, crepe paper hat piece. She still has her ribbon on the back. You got Catherine Young over here. Hey, Robert, how are you? Hey, Robert. Hey, and Kat. her arms and everything are still her little feet. Um, these have been the ones who, <laughs> that still have their dresses, their original dresses on. They are the hardest for me to part with. But I made Kelly a promise that I would thin things out, and I'm thinning, I'm thinning things out. Because she doesn't, I don't blame her. She doesn't want to be left with this if, God forbid, something happens to me. So, But look at that face All on right, her. Jennifer, now, she witnesses. is, she is a little, oh, she is like six and a quarter, she, six and a quarter inches tall. But she is just adorable. Adorable. You want a go haired baby. Well, Catherine, here you go, baby. Here's you a go haired baby. Here's you a go haired baby. But look at that. Look at, at the detail they put on this baby to even like scallop 
her ribbon back here. But we'll start the countdown on this one at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid end. Oh, I know it, Peachy May. I hated that. That was the big carnival prize one. She was like, what, 16 or 16 inches tall or something? 12 inches tall? She was big. Maybe she was 14. Right, sis? <laughs> she is so pretty. Jennifer. <laughs> did Catherine get that? Yay, Catherine. Yay, Catherine. Thank you, you sweet angel. Catherine Young got number 15. Jennifer, now I got that dog on song stuck in my head. What? Lucky what song? Star by Madonna. Okay, this next lot starts off at $16. $16, Angela. And it is a, I got to sit there a minute. I'm getting tired. You got to what? $16, and it is a, like a vintage advertising lot. $16 vintage advertising lot. Dang it. Huh? Oh, baby. Did you lose it? No. This is our Easterbrook Company uh, pens, drawlet number 11 lettering pens. It's got something in here. Can I open it? Yes, baby. You can open it. I say that as I'm opening it. It's a lot of all kind of different advertising things. You get these two ribbons. These are just things to put like in a... A box, a little, uh, if you've got a printer's box or one of those little boxes with, they're just, the fonts and everything are just so pretty to display. Yes, pen nibs. Baby. What is the, I'm trying to that say what is it is. a so cylinder, a record cylinder. It's an old timey, they used to have record players that, well, no, it wasn't record players. There were cylinder players that played these. You put it on there and a needle run like a around. Phonograph? Or something? Yes. And the needle, you put them on there like this. And the needle run around on it. It's in here. Hold on. See? Debbie Jacobs you see is that? at 16. It's like a record, baby. Oh, okay. And see, it went in here. You see how those grooves are? And there was a little thing that turned it. Kind of like they turn on a turntable. Uh -huh. This thing turned it like this. And the needle went up and down like this. So. Lenny's got a Victrola that plays them like that. It's a wax cylinder, Joe S. said. Thank wax, you, Joe Thank S. you, baby. <laughs> but this is such a good lot. And this, I don't normally find these uh, cylinder boxes in this good a condition. And so I I paid up for this. I think I paid for 14 or $15 just for this. This thing says October 1969 on the back. Mm-hmm. But it'll just be a good good lot for the font and just the advertising and things. But we are going to start the countdown mm -hmm. at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, really, Denise? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and be at end. Yes, a wax cylinder. I couldn't think what it was called, y'all. Thank y'all. Lenny said hers is her great grandfather's. That's awesome. Golly man. bomb. That's so awesome. Lenny's got one that'll actually play. Is that what she's saying? Mm -hmm. I think so. That's what the way I took it. How cool is that? Debbie Jacobs for 16. Thank you, Debbie. Thanks, Debbie. Debbie Jacobs. Debbie Jacobs, first time swimming in the blue blue. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> you love it, don't you? Bloop, bloop. Y'all got a newbie in there. Okay, yeah. Debbie, thank you. She said she'll send info. Okay, baby. And let's see. Okay. You want to do the tea towels? 
because I think I got stuff on my head. Yeah, I did. Is it? Yeah. So hold on. This is, uh, there's three in here? Yeah. Is this an offer up or a set price? Offer up. Offer up. And, uh, sis, at, starting at 12. It's for um, a lot of three tea towels. Are these vintage, Mom? Hi, uh, some of Yes. So I'm going to show you this one first. This one is white with the pretty mint green edging. That's the color of your Stanley cup. Your, your, I ain't got no Stanley cup. That's a Yeti. Your Yeti Look at that. cup. Whew. That's the first one. I'm not folding this back right. I know. Sorry. Huh? Not folding it. Oh, there's two like there's two of those, y'all. Yeah, there's two of the. There's two of the, two of the green one. This one's got a little more right here. You can't even hardly see it. That so pretty. That green is so it's pretty green. It's like a. And this one is the same size as that one. <clears throat> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then this third one, I don't know if this one is a, a little bit shorter. Or no, maybe it's about the same size. It has a bunny rabbit on it. That says, Glad Hand Designs Incorporated. I don't think this one's vintage. No, I don't think that's going to be still either. pretty. But I thought it was so pretty for spring and summer. Uh huh. So there's three tea towels in this lot. The one with the bunny, and then two. Ooh. Um, I'm sorry. Kelly, you have flunked, flunked, folded. Denise, go, oh, Kelly, you have. Flunked. Oh, I got it. Hold on. This is just, there's nothing wrong with this one. It's just a crease where it was two like this. I'll fold this one back. Watch this, Miss Denise. I'll get it. There you go. Look at you. <laughs> this green on here is so pretty. I don't think anybody. No. That right. <laughs> okay, we don't have anybody getting those. Pass. Pass. Okay, this is going to be an offer up, Angela, starting at $10. And it is for this uh, current, this is a vintage current from 1979. 1979. So it is this fruit-themed recipe box. It looks like a harvest, a garden harvest. And... How much were those towels? Oh, they were those tea towels that I just showed. $12. They were starting off at 12 But this is a current 1979. Current is the name of the company. Let me see if I can get that to show up down there. Kitchen Fair Recipe Set 1979. And $12 for it was all of $12 them. $12 for Denise. all of them, Miss Denise. It's got the dividers in there with all the different types of food you could prepare and it has two it has these that came in the these recipe cards all blank that came in there can i take your towels mom of course sure, denise of course honey hold on i'll put them i'll put you down for those towels and then you get the extra box. So it is it is just slam full of recipe cards. So if you want to do this for somebody like Kelly, when she got married, I put my favorite recipes and her favorite recipes that I have and cut her out a lot of recipes and made her a oh, bloop, Miss Denise. recipe. I used it. Oh, it was so long ago. I used like an old one of those uh, sticky film photo albums and did it, but if you want to do this for somebody that's getting married, if you don't want them yourself or if you haven't, to write down some of your favorite recipes and put them in there and then gift them this as a gift, that would mean any 
more than anything in the world to him because Kelly tells me all the time that that's one of her favorite things I've ever given her was those recipes and that. But we'll start the countdown on these at 15, 14, 13, 12. Dee did it for Jessica too. Uh, 11, that's sweet. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one and be at end. Oops. Those towels, uh, the ones with the green edging, Mr. Meese will be pretty embroidered. Yes. Oh, thank you, Denise. I think I did, but I wasn't sure. Jill Sweeney. Thank you, Jill. I knew somebody would want that because it was just too good. Jill. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jill. Swanee S. Gabby said her mom did that for me. Aww. On the back of it, she wrote, good luck. Oh, that's so sweet. And How crazy. sweet. Jill Swanee's going in the Do bed. you, Denise? Well, that'd be perfect <laughs> for her then. <laughs> she can make her some for you to sell. Yeah. Okay, this next piece is a little lot, Angela. This next lot is starting off at $18, baby. $18. And it is for three, uh, there's three pieces in this. Um, oh, <laughs> in a sassy way. There's three pieces in this lot. First up is this um, cut crystal trinket dish. And this it is, is in perfect pretty. condition, and it just the, the light just sparkles off it's of it. Sparkling, and you get this antique little metal change purse. It looks like it would have went on a chatelaine, but I think it's too big to have gone on a chatelaine. I'm not sure, but it, it puts you in mind of that. Here's the inside of it. This wouldn't have been for the fancy woman. This would have been for the, the worker bee, the worker bee in the house, like a servant or something. And you get this silver. Is that metal? Yes, it's metal. And you get this silver pearlized glass stick pen. So you get all, let me hold it for you. You get all three pieces in the lot. <clears throat> This little metal purse is so cute. Yes, Cindy. What? She said that her mom hand hand wrote a cookbook for her and her sister. It's a prize possession right there in that comment. Oh right. yes. It's at the top. Now put this down over there. All right. Good night, Danny. Thank you for joining us. I have never seen, I know it, Dee. It is just so it's textured like it would be fabric, but it is metal. It is just, it is just strictly metal. Now it's got some pretty embossing and things, a design on it, you know. And the inside, but I just, I just picture this being like somebody in the household, like uh, that would keep the money, have to keep money in here to pay for like the milk and the eggs and the. Stuff when TDSLP Tracy, how are you? I haven't seen you in a while. Hope everything's good. Bye, Danny. Thank you for coming, honey. We'll start the countdown on this little lot at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, mm -hmm. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and be at end. It's different, ain't it? Mm -hmm. I've never seen one. I see Angela. Hey, Shari. Hey, Shari. That's all I have to do. Okay, Auntie Gabby for 27. Yay, Gabby. Auntie Gabby. Thank you, Auntie Gabby, and thank Thanks you to everyone everybody. else who's bidding. 
It's pretty. Hey. So oh, I'll take it, baby. If you. Um. <laughs> God bless you, darling. Thank you. You can just set it right down in here, baby, and you can show this for me. Cause you know it's a. Now this is all about you. This is an eighties jewelry. Girl. This is the what? This is an eighties jewelry. Eighties jewelry. Yes. This this was when your mama was all that in a box of crackers, honey. Okay. Okay. When my when my uh when, when my figure would still stop a clock. <laughs> stop, a clock. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> all right. Sis, this is an offer up starting at twelve. It's for this nineteen eighties <laughs> gold tone necklace. It's light. It look. I think it looks like it may be heavy because of how thick it is. But it's it's not as heavy as you. Would, it's not heavy like. And it think. feels so good on. It just. It's very well made. It's not signed by a maker or anything. It's just very very well made. But it just slides. Uh, it's just like butter. I mean, it's just. It's really really nice. I'm going slow so y'all can see. Ha <laughs> ha! Day said her. She can stop a train. <laughs> Y'all are both very pretty. Train stoppers. And uh, clock stoppers. Y'all, I, I think it does have... I uh, excuse me? I didn't see it. Baby, my eyes. This is Trafari. Excuse me? This is Trafari. I shall show well, you. Well, no wonder it's such and so nice. Let me put it on so they can see how pretty it hangs on your neck. It's, it's, I loved this. I'll put it on you. I wore the doll mess out of it. Stand by. Stand by. This hair. Kelly? It's in the way. Kelly, what? Don't. You got to you gotta turn it back around like that. Have I got it right? Yes, it's just that it's about to go like that. Okay. See how pretty. It's very, very, very pretty. Yes, Trafari. Kelly, Kelly said, stand by. Stand by. That pollen's getting to us, ain't it, Kelly? Nope, sure. <laughs> oh. But it is just so pretty. But we'll start the countdown on this piece at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and bid end. It is so pretty. Look at the detail in these little links. Those links is what I like. They're they're the way that they they just you, flow they flow together. It's like water, isn't it? <laughs> mm -hmm. I say yes. Yeah, see the uh, Trafari. Deborah Williams for Yay. thirteen. Thanks, Deborah. This is Deborah Williams' first purchase. Okay. Thank you, baby. Keeping me in line. Uh -oh. Okay, now here's the giveaways tonight. So let's see. Bloop, bloop. Is it already nine o'clock? Yeah. Damn. Okay, you've got your choice tonight for the giveaways between these two little Miss Cheryl Cornette. That's so sweet. These two little uh, <clears throat> rabbit memo holders, little rabbit memo holders. They're very shiny, little wooden rabbit memo holders. Got a little clothespin on the back. We got two of those, so you can have your choice of one of those or the uh, Lauren Conrad stud earrings. These are pierced. Mm -hmm. So you get 
choose a bunny or the Lauren Clyde red earrings, whichever one you want. Oh, sure, that's awesome. All right, the first winner uh -oh, is Miss LaDonna. <gasps> LaDonna, do you want the Lauren Conrad studs or would you like a rabbit baby? <laughs> Dee said, I need something. Oh, I need something bigger than that for a memory holder. <laughs> The studs, okay, Miss Ladonna. Which color? Which color? Blue. Or These are like a um, blue green color. Those are teal like. And then these are like a pink, like a blush. You just let me know which ones, baby, and I'll put you down for them. Oh, let me get over here to the giveaways. Giveaway one goes to teal. Ladonna. Yay. I'm right on the back of her thing. Teal. Studs. Teal earrings. Okay. Thank you, baby. I'll put those over here. Next. Hey, Chrissy. Oh, thanks, Chrissy. Oh, the Tulip Festival. Oh, my How gosh. fun. Kelly Miss, would die. I love tulips. It's my favorite flower. Virginia, hello. Miss Virginia. Miss Virginia, would you want the rabbit or the pierced earrings, baby? I think Virginia's ear, not pierced. I don't think Virginia has pierced. You never know. She might want to give them to somebody. See, See what earrings. Blush studs. Virginia. Blush earrings. Thank y'all so much. And don't forget now, I will be invoicing uh, tomorrow, packing tomorrow, invoicing tomorrow night if I can get through with it. It may be Monday morning before I completely get through with the invoicing, but I just need to do it because Gabby's coming Wednesday. <laughs> and don't forget about um, Trisha at Sandy and Otto has a sale right after me tonight at uh, nine o'clock central, but yes, she starts Mr. right Donna. after I get through. Thanks, y'all. And, um, yes, Gabby comes Wednesday, and then Cindy, Cindy comes, comes right after Gabby leaves. Mm -hmm. So, I have I have my buddy, two of my buddies here for the next two weeks. But y'all have a good night, everybody, and mwah, good night, stay Lamar. Safe. I appreciate y'all so much, and we love you. And oh, Auntie Gabby, I got your text, and I've done that. You too. Bye, Good night, Karina. Good night, everybody. Hey, Wendy Melton. Good we night. love y'all. Good night, babies. <laughs>